Okay, this is uh, build number one of the RC Explorer Tricopter version 2.5. Um, I took the PDF plans, uh, changed them a little bit, I took the basic idea um, and changed it to that. Um, so that's what I'll be cutting out, the outline. Um, the curves here. It's going to make it a little bit bigger, uh, a little less fancy cutting, uh, and a little bit stronger. Uh, I'm not worried about the weight penalty. So I've drawn them onto this, uh, this piece of birch uh, plywood. It's uh, actually a real nice piece of plywood. And I'm going to cut them out, two plates and the part for the camera mount below and I'll cut them out on my uh, Ryobi uh, scroll saw and that's it so um, I'm sure everybody's seen a scroll saw work before so I'm not going to get too into that but anyways I'm going to cut them out and and we'll be back. All right, so I've got one cut out now. Um, I was just checking that it matched up uh, with the, the other drawing that it, I drew it out properly and it was nice and even and it is, so that's no problem. What I'll do now is cut the other one out, and then I've got a a uh, bench belt sander, and I'll clean them up and make them all nice and smooth and nice. And since it's actually a nice plywood, I'm not sure. I might even stain them. I'm not sure what I'm going to do just just yet, but it's got a nice green and stuff. I guess you won't be able to see most of it anyway, so anyways, uh, I'll keep cutting up more pieces. Alright, I've cut out the two body pieces and the uh, GoPro camera mount. So, there they are right there. What I'm going to do is attach these two together. Um, so they're, I mean they're pretty darn close right now. Um, but I just kind of rough cut them on my scroll saw. I'm going to take them to my uh, belt sander and clean them up, look them, make them look nice. Um, and anyways, that's going to be my body plates, top and bottom. And one of the reasons why I expanded these and made them a little beefier is because I'm using a little bit bigger um, arms. I think he calls for a 10 mil arm and this is half inch which is just slightly bigger so they'll actually bolt in right like that. Right? So there'll be one there and another one on the other side and then another one in between the bolts for the back like that. So I just made it so it fit the materials that I have. All right. 